Right arm over the wicket, balls to Hamid, and that's the first runs of the day. The first runs of the game, a back foot drive from Hamid, and it will go all the way to the extra cover boundary to his career at New Road. And there's Leach again, round the wicket, balls and duck it drives through the covers for good shot. Over pitch from Leach. Next delivery from Smith, bowls him! Oh. Absolutely superb delivery from Nathan Smith. Has taken two stumps out of the ground. And Asiba Mead is a pretty miserable start to the season. The season is cursed with bad luck as Smith bowls. And that is very, very elegant indeed from Ben Slater. Just rocked back and pulled it away. Smith bowls to Slater and he's uh, angled this with an open face between third and fourth slip. And I think there's enough pace on that to go all the way to the pavilion rope there is. So Slater gets a boundary. Two Slater, four this time, short and wide, cut away behind square between fourth slip and backward point. Past umpire Debenham, balls to the left-handed Slater who drives through the offside for four. It was over pitch, a little bit of width offered by Holder and Slater, eager to feed on that. One quite close, one a little bit deeper. Smith bowls, Clark drives on the offside. Handsome, beautiful shot actually, best shot he's played. And uh, it gets him four, despite mm. Golovira's chase down towards the scoreboard. The aforementioned round the wicket in now to bowl to Slater, who drives for four. Over pitched outside off stump, and Slater not going to miss out on that. Put it away. And a stationary catching position at short extra. Next one's driven just out of his reach to his left and away for four runs through the offside. Driven away by. Joe Clark, very, very little response. As this one's again driven through the offside. Once more, two Worcestershire fielders, um, Kashi Fali and Rob Jones, diving. Play some games with this ball and some games with that ball as uh, Slater again latches onto a Baker full toss and gets it through the offside for another boundary. So he moves to 49 here, Ben Slater. Good to have the. Worcestershire supporters here, down the leg side, I fancy LBW shout was not too confident. Now let's have a look at the umpire, no signal, so there was some bat involved. Picture of the kookaburra alongside the Next ball sees Clark come again and that's skimmed along the ground. Comes in, bowls and that's short and wide and Clark, he is in the mood now, it's almost as though He's changed gear and he's on the back foot and he just thumps that away through extra cover. Next ball sent by Baker and here he comes again and there it goes again. That one has uh, got a first class stamp on it as it goes deep into the uh, lower tier of the Radcliffe Road down County in the past. I remember the first time he went back to New Road he uh, got a duck but on this occasion here at Trent Bridge he gets a half century, a hundred. Last week in the first innings against Essex, 50 here from 88 ball. James Coyne from the cricketer, watching on here is now uh, oh. Ben Slater comes and has a huge slice of luck. Finch, balls again, short, short, pulled away by Slater onto the leg side, fielder out there who flung himself at it. Who's that, Frank? Can Smith, you see? I think. Nathan Smith, the key. We've got the first two wickets this morning. It's uh, it's four runs, but. Just fancy that might have been in the air. 57 runs in 40 minutes here as uh, the next ball is uh, just cut out of the reach of the diving holder at slip. He's the sole slipper holder and he's sort of in no man's land somewhere around about uh, second slip. Hope you're enjoying your day, mate. By the sound of it, you are. This is short and Slater has pulled this one away. He's got underneath that and Ben Slater now lifts. Actually made his first class debut on this ground for Worcestershire in that pink ball game a few years ago. This one's dragged down the leg side for four by Clark. This is where you want to be bowling at so-and-so. Next ball pulled away again by Clark. That's four more. Hit very, very hard. Back-to-back -back boundaries and Joe Clark getting a hurry up on here. Now gone to uh, to 67. Rather too regularly. This is down the leg side and given they've got a wicket this time. Leg side strangle and Slater has to go. Finch, you'd have to say that's a poor ball because it's always angling down the leg side. Slater went to flick it away and he's tickled it through to Gareth Roderick. In again, bowls and uh, Montgomery will get his first boundary here. Wide half volley to be fair from Holder and he just leans into it and uh, well, it wasn't really a full bloody drive, just pushed it into the gap. Oh this, oh, this is edged and caught. Good catch by Holder. 
big man, really big wicket. It's Matthew Montgomery who failed in both innings last week and he's gone for 11 this time. Had a little flash at that one from Nathan Smith who gets his third wicket of the day. As the, uh, as the cricket manager, Phil Neal, as Clark pulls this away on the leg side and Joe Leach out there on the fence. The first thing Joe Leach did was turn and start looking towards the sky. Six more to Joe Clark. Oliver in again to Haynes, Bowles tosses this one up wide outside the off stump and Haynes drives very nicely for four, beats the tumbling Rob Jones on the extra cover boundary. 21 for four against Derbyshire as Baker bowls, he, uh, Clark cuts this for four, so he goes to 97 with two balls left, double Nelson on the board, 2-2-2 two, two, two for four. In balls and that's short and wide and Clark cracks it away off the back foot he's only going to get or he'll get two I was going to say he's yeah, only going to get a single but Rob Jones fell over so 100 sorry that's why you were doing it isn't it Bowles and Haynes is taken on the pads a big shout for LBW and he's given he can't believe it Jack Haynes he's got his head in his hands he cannot believe it really really good read and there's a wicket for Baker as Clark goes to court and he's gone for 105. Disappointment again. Clark has to trudge off. Bowling's from this end, so it doesn't matter, but a few people wandering about. Next one's cut away by James for a boundary behind uh, point. Here's Finch down the leg side. That's uh, four runs tickled very fine down to the fine leg boundary leach in balls that's wide and hammered through the covers for four by james a gift from leach smith still running in as purposefully as he did at the start of the day and that's a lovely looking shot square of the wicket on the leg side for four by calvin harrison just strayed slightly onto a leg stump line there, Smith, and Harrison's worked that away. That was a Ooh, sentence. Four runs well, off the edge. this has come off the shoulder of the bat. I think it's a no ball, so this could be six to Nottinghamshire. Four to Calvin Harrison, but it's a no ball. So uh, two against Holder. Smith in, balls, back foot drive by James. Beautiful shot, actually. Probably as good a shot, well, certainly as good a shot as he's played. Short extra on the catch, and he bowls. His first ball is pushed through quite quickly mm. and dropped a bit short and very easily clipped through. Brilliant stuff today. Started watching the live stream just after lunch with Clark and Slater going well. Glad to see James and Harrison see the day out and gain the second point. Thank you, Yellow Belly. Appropriate note to end the day on as Lyndon James bowls to, uh, I beg your pardon, Lyndon James pushes the ball back to Jason Holder.